What is AI like after 2028? Hey everyone, welcome to our channel. If you're new here, welcome. And consider subscribing to my channel and click that little bell notification below. You surely have clicked the I am not a robot button more than a few times last week. And did you get a chance to ask yourself why you had to do it? CAPTCHA stops software robots from completing a process by including a test only humans can pass. A test that mostly includes ticking pictures, something only we humans can do. And why do they need to stop bots from accessing the internet? That's a question I'm not going to answer. Instead, let's see how AI comes into play. AI, or artificial intelligence, is a program that runs on a series of algorithms. Different AIs need different algorithms depending on the task they're designed for. This concept of artificial intelligence, or giving machines the ability close to human intelligence to perform certain tasks, was first developed by Marvin Minsky and John McCarthy in 1956. Since then, AI has faced many ups and downs and developed into what it is today. Today, AI is everywhere, from virtual assistants like Alexa, to the internet predictions of what we might want to buy next, to self-driving automobiles. So how will it be in the next few years? What changes in AI can we expect in 2028? Let's see. In the upcoming years and throughout the following century, how we live, work, play, and experience humanity as a whole will alter drastically. The epidemic, upcoming pandemics, and other catastrophes will continue to accelerate AI adoption even further. The fact that AI is currently developing across all three dimensions of computation, data, and algorithms establishes the context for its eventual acceptance throughout all areas of life and work. We might have to live in an AI-powered, AI-driven world, the AI-enabled future where no significant industry will be untouched by AI. Every day, artificial intelligence impacts our choices and way of life, as AI is used across many industries. With a vast range of potential applications, AI has the power to change several industries drastically. These many sectors and use cases have one thing in common. They are all data-driven. A significant turning point has arrived for AI initiatives, businesses, and investments, as many move from failure to success. The future of AI projects is looking better. Companies that learn, adapt, and mobilize rapidly will be in the lead better prepared to deploy and eventually achieve profitability and capture part of the benefit of AI. According to Cognolytica's four-part AI-enabled future vision, there are four major ways in which AI will affect our future lives. The way we work, the way we live, the way we experience the environment and our connections with one another, our relationship with data. Many of the tedious and repetitive tasks that have been delegated to service workers are being eliminated by AI. It's here to stay in business due to the usage of various process automation techniques, from the less intelligent robotic process automation to the more sophisticated cognitive automation forms. In a short time, there will likely be many more software and hardware bots controlling the back and front offices of enterprises than actual people working there. We will be surrounded by autonomous systems pervasive in our daily lives thanks to the convergence of computer vision, machine learning, natural language processing, predictive analytics, and the world of intelligent sensors and devices. AI will soon be a part of our daily lives outside our professional ones. In order to improve our day-to-day -day relationships with one another, foster our creativity, and provide us with new avenues for self-expression, we will eventually come to rely on and even employ AI systems. Perhaps a more realistic near-future prospect is that artificially intelligent technologies will eventually replace a large portion of present manual labor. Even though AI won't eliminate all employment, it will undoubtedly affect the nature of work. The only open question is how quickly and dramatically automation will change the workplace. So what changes can we expect by 2028? By 2023, instead of corporate data centers, more than 50% of new enterprise infrastructure deployments will be made. Deepfakes will be used in 0% of successful account takeover attacks as part of social engineering attacks generated by AI with second-order implications. Due to AI and other developing technologies that lower access barriers, the number of employed persons with impairments will increase by three times. 
in at least four of the G7 nations, the self-regulating organization for the supervision of AI and machine learning designers will be created. Blockchain-based deepfake technology will authenticate up to 30% of global news and media content. By 2024, the worldwide digital ad market will be expected to double and surpass US $600 billion. The market for algorithmic trading powered by AI is anticipated to increase by $4 billion, reaching a total volume of $19 billion. There will be an 800% increase in the number of edge apps, computer vision, voice, natural language processing, and ARVR will be enabled by AI for more than 50% of user interactions. 75% of businesses will operationalize AI. 80% of new business technology might be produced outside of IT thanks to the development of low-code and no-code technologies. More than 50% of the web advertisements you view will be influenced by AI's ability to identify emotions. With 8.4 billion devices, voice assistants equipped with natural language processing technology may outnumber humans. 60% of AI suppliers will incorporate harm or misuse mitigation into their products. Nearly 69% of the manager's workload will be replaced by AI and other technologies like chatbots and virtual personal assistants. By 2025, AI will be included in at least 90% of new workplace apps. There will be an increase in data production of 163 zettabytes. 95% of all customer contacts will be powered by AI, including live phone and internet discussions where customers won't be able to identify the bot. 26 smart cities will be created from scratch. These cities will be forced to concentrate on creating collaborative, data-driven infrastructure for use in healthcare, public security services, and other areas due to an unclear post-pandemic situation. AI will record and analyze 75% of workplace talks, allowing for the identification of new organizational values or dangers. A new voice of society metric will be used by 30% of large organizations to address societal concerns and evaluate the effects on their financial performance. Thanks to augmented reality advances, cell phones will become obsolete. To manage non-human labor, at least two of the top 10 worldwide retailers will create robot resource organizations. Healthcare institutions will use more preventative health methods based on the growing body of knowledge surrounding the health advantages of eating diets high in plants and nutrients. In the 15 industries and 26 economies, a change in the division of labor between humans and machines might result in the displacement of 85 million jobs, while 97 million new positions could develop that are better suited to the new division of labor between human, machines, and algorithms. Elon Musk warns that by 2025, artificial intelligence services will surpass human capabilities. By 2026, AI-powered passive fund assets are believed to surpass active funds on the stock market. By 2027, the market for AI chips is anticipated to generate $83.25 billion in sales, and truck drivers will lose their jobs. By 2028, artificial intelligence will create more money than human workers. The development of AI won't stop there. By 2029, AI will be able to pass the Turing test. Artificial intelligence will reach human-level intelligence by 2030. At that point, people will begin employing robots for companionship and household tasks. By then, the healthcare industry would take the lead. Based on use cases, the healthcare market has been divided into categories such as robot-assisted surgery, dosage error reduction, virtual nursing assistance, clinical trial participant identification, hospital workflow management, preliminary diagnosis, and automated image diagnostic. By 2040, people will be able to utilize AI to control their home settings. By 2045, buildings will have AI so that you can communicate with them directly. This will allow us to live virtually in a matrix-like environment. People's minds could be connected to computers in the 2045 to 2050 timeframe to the point that they feel like they're living in virtual reality. By 2050, AI technology will be able to read emotions to customize each client's experience. Then our daily interactions will be a mix of humans, AI-enabled machines, and hybrids. 
By then, many things will change for good. You'll be able to request a personalized movie while lounging on the couch with the virtual actors of your choice. Your precise genome will be used to tailor treatments. Doctors and hospitals will be able to better evaluate data and tailor treatment to each patient's genes, surroundings, and lifestyle thanks to AI algorithms. You don't need to be concerned about cybersecurity breaches since self-learning and automated skills of AI can protect data more consistently and affordably. AI aids will enable seniors to live independently and longer in their own homes as AI technologies will maintain a supply of wholesome food, safely access items on high shelves, and keep an eye on movement. 100 years from now, the world will be totally different. Now I'm not going to tell you how, but I will leave some hints. Imagine space colonization, living underground and underwater, flying cars, metapods, and all the things you've seen in movies. Yes, they're yet to come. So now you can either choose to be happy or scared of the AI-powered future we are about to experience.